Messi's been a naughty boy. Messi's been a naughty boy. Um, how do I break this down? Face value. It's crazy. So shout out to Jun and Laurent who pretty much broke everything down on ESPN FC. So I think it was Laurent. <laughs> Laurel or Laurent. If you win or draw, you have Monday off training. If you lose, everybody has to come into training on Monday. PSG lost. Then only five points. Claire at the top against Marseille. And Messi decided just to go to Saudi Arabia without speaking to Gatia or El Khalafi. Go to Saudi Arabia because he's got he's an ambassador at Saudi Arabia. Therefore, without saying to anybody that can I still go, and everybody else turning off for morning training because they lost on Sunday, he's now being suspended. So on face value, oh, it, it makes sense. And I think that if you're one of those PSG teammates, you're like, wait, what the hell? You can't do that. And I think what is so bad is PSG fans already have a special kind of... They've not really ingratiated themselves towards Messi because they feel that like you've not done anything for us at PSG. Like, we brought you here because we thought you would be the difference maker in the UCL. And in those key UCL games, you've not really pulled through. So what was the point of even buying you? We didn't buy you for the freaking Uber Eats or Uber Cups. We bought you for the UCL and you've done nothing in the UCL. Shout out to you getting your welcome to everything. But as a PSG fan, you've done nothing. So this will make things even worse for Messi. So he's now been suspended for two weeks now because he didn't sign up for training. So even when he comes back, what, 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 what's it going to be? So PSG are fully within their rights. 100% they're fully within their rights. But this is the difficulty. It's the culture of PSG. Because when I heard this news, I was like, okay. Because we've been saying this for a long time. PSG is run as a holiday camp. The psychos are running the asylum. Let's be real. And this is the issue that Emery had. And even Tuchel as well. Tuchel said... You're not really a football manager here. You have to be doing other different things. Emery, his power was usurped by Neymar. So, the thing though is, what Messi did was wrong, but I'm not surprised that he did that because, see, this is different from, let's say, like the United situation. I, I don't want to do a whole Ronaldo Messi thing, but look, okay, forget that. Let's say Benzema um, turned up late for training or so forth for Real Madrid. Oh, bro, come on. You're, you're a full base on what Real Madrid is. Let's say um, Joshua Kimmich turned up late for training, or he didn't turn up to, to training uh, against Bayern Bro, because Bayern and Real Madrid, there is, a, there is a decorum that goes back decades as to how they operate. There's a professionalism where the club is bigger than any set player. Guys, that's PSG. The players are bigger than the club. Mbappe is bigger than PSG. Neymar is bigger than PSG. And Messi is bigger than PSG. And you've created a culture where I'm sure Messi felt that, oh yeah, I can I can do this. Would Messi do this at Barcelona? Probably not. Who knows? Maybe. Based on, on his power. So, my thing though is, guys, my, I've, I've got to just be honest with you. When I saw the way that PSG so embarrassingly limped out of the UCL. I was like, break break this thing up. You still have my video. I said, break this thing up. It's over. This project is over. It's finitoed. There's nothing more. Break it up. Try and actually create a proper team. You're trying to um, buy your way into UCL by getting all these egos and private donors. It's failed. The Mbappe, Neymar, Messi thing, it's failed. So Messi doing this, in my view, he's out. So I believe he's, I think he's a free agent. This summer, bro, Messi, just go to MLS. Go to MLS, ball out, have anything. Or, do you know what this is? Guys, this is a claim negation. Messi's out. There's no way he's signing a contract extension. So, you're either going to see Messi back at Barcelona, which I think is the most likely destination, or you're going to see him at Inter Miami. But the thing, though, is for PSG and everything is, look, you created this monster. So, based on the kind of culture you've created, as much as you are fully within the right. And Messi is totally in the wrong. Messi, 100, on face value, Messi, you're in the wrong. Because, bro, no. That is total disrespect. Disrespect to your employer who is paying you very handsomely. And that is total disrespect to your teammates. Everyone else joined up. Everyone else turned up on, on Monday and you left. So, 100%, Messi is wrong. But bigger picture beyond this, who cares? Who cares? Look at how PSG has been run. It's been run as a freaking clown show. It has been run as a freaking clown show. And for me, with this, this is just like, okay... 
fine, all right, whatever, you know. And I just say this for, for PSG right now. Break it up. Break this whole, whole thing up and let's just move on. Hit that website, the official website, halfofcutballhops.com, and check out those other videos, man. One love.